Namaskar to all the students of class seven. Today in the physics class, we shall do learn about the electric fuses. Okay, last class I have taught you about the heating effects of electric current, how the electric current produces heat. That I have taught you already. Now today we shall. I will let you know about the electric fuses. What are the electric fuses? Now, electric fuses are nothing but now last day I said that that I said in the last class I said that when large amount of current is passing through the wire, what will happen? The wire will melt, right? That means a circuit breakdown happened. Now, wires are made from some special materials. Okay, wires are made from special materials which melt quickly and break the and break down when the large amount of current is flowing through them now these wires are used for making the electric fuses now in the electric fuses you are having that kind of wire so when the when loads of current when huge amount of current will flow through the wire what will happen it will melt and the circuit will break and hence the current will not flow through the appliances hence you are safe so in the tall buildings, the fuses are inserted in all the electric circuits. There is a maximum limit on the current which can safely flow through a circuit. Now, in the circuit at your home or any in offices, in everywhere, the electric circuit it has some specific limit, safe known as the safe current limit. It could be 10 ampere or 14 ampere, and you all know the SI unit of current is ampere. So there is a specific limit for the current to pass through it huge amount of current cannot pass through it okay so there is a limit there is a maximum limit on the current and the, if that limit exceeds then only it the fuse will the wire in the fuse will melt and it will break the circuit so if by accident the current exceeds the safe limit the wires will become overheated right so excessive amount of current is passing what will happen it is exceeding the maximum limit that means the wire cannot withstand that current so it is becoming overheated and due to that it may cause fire so if a proper fuse is there in the circuit what will happen it will blow off and it will break the circuit so a fuse is a very very necessary device that should it is a very very necessity and safety device which prevents the further damage any damage to the electric circuit and possible fires okay so nowadays fuses are of this kind see the figure is given 14.15 so fuses which is inserted in the circuit okay in the circuit it is inserted and now the fuses are used for many purposes okay it is used in our houses uh, it is used in many way electric fuses are used so electric fuses are inserted nothing see it's just a wire is there okay which has been when it is becoming overheated exceeding the maximum safe limit then it breaks and what will happen if it breaks so what will happen further current will not pass through it and hence your house or the electrical appliances will be safe it will not create any damage or it will not <clears throat> create it will not create any fire now see next we're having that mcb now nowadays instead of fuses in place of fuses we are using this mcbs now what is the meaning of mcb full form it is miniature circuit breaker okay you will see at your home you will see there are mcbs now one mcb is related to many devices okay certain appliances again few appliances are related to certain mcbs so instead of fuses we are using mcbs now these are the auto these these are certain kind of switches okay so it will automatically turn off when the current in the circuit exceeds the safe limit now if the ncb could sense that the current that there is a heavy flow of the current what will happen these switches will automatically fall down you will see these switches will automate this is automatical switches so this will turn off and you after that you can turn them on and the circuit is once again complete okay 
understood so these are mcbs are now inserted so what is happening these are automatical switches so when there is a heavy flow of the current it will automatically fall down that means it is off the circuit is off now again you have to turn on for completing the circuit okay so these are fuses mcbs these are also safety devices these are all the safety devices now next you are having the magnetic effect of the electric current now the brief introduction i am giving you details we shall study in the next class magnetic effects of current is nothing that means electric current i have said that electric current can produce heat as well as electric current can also produce the magnetic effect okay so when any current is passing through the wire it produces magnetic field around it okay it produces a magnetic field around it so this magnetic effects of current you could just read go through activity 14.5 in details i shall teach you in the next class okay so now in this class i have taught you the electrical fuses and mcbs you go through that very nicely the book you read the ncrt book very nicely try to understand this and next we are having the in next class i will start the new topic namashivaya